I have a little thought tonight. It's in Luke 10.10. 10. But whatever city you enter and they do not receive you, go out into the streets and say, The very dust of your city which clings to us will we wipe off against you. Nevertheless, know this, that the kingdom of God has come near you. But I say to you that it will be more tolerable in that day for the Sodom than for that city. Woe to you, Chorazin! Woe to you, Bethsaida! For if the mighty works which were done in you had been done in Tyre and Sodom, they would have repented long ago, sitting in sackcloth and ashes. But it would be more tolerable for Tyre and Sodom at the judgment than for you. And you, Capernaum, who are exalted to heaven, will be brought down to Hades. Who He who ha hears you hears me, and he who rejects you rejects me, and he who rejects me rejects him who sent me. My thought tonight, my thought tonight is pretty simple. There are people who come to your door and you, like me, try to show them as best you can that they are not following the right way and that they're in danger of being cast into hell. And you give them all the evidence that you possibly can. But that is what shows here in Luke 10, 10, all the way down through to 16 there are some people who no matter what you show them no matter what they see who says that they saw signs and wonders so no matter what they see no matter what they hear no matter what you tell them they are not going to believe and it's going to be more tolerable for the people of Sodom and the people of Tyre and Sodom than for them especially their leaders. For they were deceived. They are the ones who are being deceived. But the deceivers are in even worse shape. That's my thought. Have a good night.